thank you for watching. Look, I really want to give you a market update, especially what's happening out in the world at the moment. What's factual, what's non-factual, what's happening with my property, what's happening with my tenant, is there anything I need to know? And again, smoke alarms. First of all, we're an essential service. We've still got to collect rent, we still provide shelter. So no problems there. And so far, all the tenants have been fantastic in regards to rent payments. Um, letting tradies in is a little bit tougher. So what can we do? We still operate seven days a week. The phones are on, they're all diverted to me seven days a week. Um, the only thing we can't do, we cannot do conduct routine inspections, we cannot do open homes, cannot do auctions. And that's it, it's business as usual. But with the maintenance we're getting, because we're not physically seeing it ourselves, we're getting the tenants to send photos and videos of the problem so that we really get a good understanding of what the problem is. So they're the restrictions for both landlord and tenant and we can work with that and hopefully by this weekend some common sense gets passed down and um, we can go back to business as usual regarding our industry. What's the property market doing? This is my third 10 year cycle. I've never experienced anything like it. Usually with these booming cycles, they drop off very sharply. Sharply, This hasn't happened. This started around, started to increase around September last year and every month and every quarter just gets better than the last. Property prices in Ipswich continue to rise. The migration to Ipswich is unbelievable. So today's Wednesday, I listed a property for sale on Monday. It got sold within a few hours. Multiple offers. I had private inspections and I had the video inspections all happening at once. It was crazy. Listed another property for sale yesterday. We've sold it today. We sold that property um, $25,000 above the asking price and the inquiries are still coming in. It's crazy. So it's great for property owners in Queensland. If you did want to sell, don't worry about COVID because it hasn't made any difference to the buyers. It's only increased their fear and panic in wanting to buy. But if you're wanting to hold and build your super, there's never been a better time as well because the migration from down south just is increasing the property values here in Ipswich. And we are getting a lot of people for not just residential, but for commercial and industrial as well, wanting to move out here to Ipswich to set up their operations because the land's cheaper and we've got a lot of it. Um, so that's the market update. Smoke alarms, please folks, just to let you know how critical this is, the jobs we're booking in this month, the, the backlog is that big, they're not getting done until the end of October coming into November. Those landlords that keep telling me, oh, we're gonna wait till November, December, you simply won't get it done, and after the 31st of December, we can't manage your property, okay? You'll have to manage it yourself and take on that risk. So please let us get your smoke alarms done. We still have several hundred landlords that won't give me permission to make their properties compliant. And um, I just wanna let you know too, from my other videos, you're not insured. And if there's fatality, yeah, you're off to jail. So it, it's that serious. So please get your smoke alarms done. Let us do it for you. We've already done the quotes. We're sending them out all the time. Uh, maybe our emails are going to the junk email or spam, I don't know, but you really need to contact us about these smoke alarms and just let us help you. So I hope this helps. Have a great day. If you have any questions, please give me a call.